What's up guys, Sal here. So, firmware builds for the Galaxy Tab S4 was leaked online. As expected, folks over at XDA developers did a teardown of Samsung's Air Command app and discovered a number of new S Pen features coming to the Tab S4 that will likely debut on the Note 9 as well. So, here are the things that the S Pen will be able to do. Control music with the S Pen, just like you do with the earbuds with the play or pause button. Use the S Pen as a remote camera shutter. This will surely come in handy if you are taking group photos and have your phone propped somewhere. Press and hold the pen button to open any app or S Pen feature. Set up single and double press pen actions. Expanded Air Command integration, I mean more apps will have support for unique S Pen features. And finally, remotely unlock the Galaxy Note 9 with the S Pen out of the phone. I'm not sure how this is gonna work, I guess if the phone is unlocked and you take out the S Pen and for some reason the phone gets locked again, you can simply unlock the phone remotely with the S Pen. There's not much context here so it's hard to say how exactly it's gonna work or if it's secure. But thankfully we're only a couple of weeks away from the launch so we'll find out soon. There's this unboxing video of the Note 9 making rounds on the internet. A couple of you guys sent me this video yesterday and as soon as I opened the video, I knew it's a fake. The most obvious giveaway is the Note 9 logo. The Note 9 should look like this. How do I know? Well, I have the fonts that Samsung uses for their products and it doesn't take a genius to say it's a clone. Also Samsung Mobile.News did a great job of explaining other issues with the box on their Twitter handle. The funny thing is, a lot of big websites are calling this an early unboxing video of the Note 9, which is obviously not true. So yeah, don't fall for it guys. So Samsung will launch the Note 9 on August 9th. Alongside with that, they are also expected to launch a Galaxy Watch. Now it looks like they'll also launch a new wireless charger known as Wireless Charger Duo. Unlike any of the company's previous wireless chargers, this one can charge both the Galaxy Watch and the Note 9 at the same time. Or you can even charge two compatible smartphones at the very same time. It's rumored that it will cost £55 in the UK but no additional details about the pricing in other regions are available at the moment. But I'll surely keep you guys posted once I hear more about it. I told you. I told you so. Didn't I tell you? I hate to say, but I told you so. Told ya. Okay.